Hi friends, uh, this is my brand new uh, rock uh, Dutch oven. This is a 5 liter capacity, and I just wanted to show you this is my large uh, skillet. Around 10.5 inch skillet. So I have had it for around two years, and you can see that it's kind of uh, quite a bit uh, nicely seasoned. Uh, I've been using it and I've been seasoning it regularly in the past few weeks. So that's where you can see the black color. I've uh, taken some extra effort so that these sides are also nicely uh, seasoned. Okay, so my so the I just got it today. You can see the package here. I just arrived today in the afternoon around two o'clock, and I managed to wash it and keep it. I did not wipe it. The plan was to season it right away, so I did not wipe it. Uh, but I couldn't do it. I had some other work. So you can see that these rust stains appeared then and there. Mm, so it's my partially my mistake. Okay. So you can see the. I don't know how much you can see. This has a kind of a coppery. I'll keep this together. So you can see the change in the difference in the colors. Yeah. So you can see the difference in the colors. This is kind of black, and that is kind of having a copperish tinge. Um, so i have not yet seasoned it i'm not doing, done anything yet so so this is the manufacturer's instruction which came along with the rock and rock cast dutch oven so you can see is it hand wash dry rub with cooking oil so one good thing is that if it can be used in induction oven electric gas so this is heavy this is a 6.3 uh, kg uh, item so both of this and this lid is pretty heavy so this is the manufacturer's instruction which has come it says wash the product with mild detergent dry it with clean cloth apply oil generously on working surface heat it at low flame till it smokes switch off the flame switch off the stove and allow it to cool now you're good to go what today i'm just going to do I said no I got it around 2 30 and right now the time is around 6 o'clock and it has shown this rust stains because I did not wipe it so that is my mistake but it also means that it requires a good amount of seasoning before I can use it I will not be using though it says that just season it a bit I would be giving it at least two rounds of seasoning before I cook because um, even in Amazon reviews, I heard the same thing that it does require a good seasoning. And another thing is that see the, the difference in the copper. This it's like a copper uh, tint. So you can uh, you, you understood the difference, right? So a well seasoned pan would have this kind of a color, and it doesn't have. Okay, so that is another reason why I would want to de season it. So uh, another important thing is that uh, as per Amazon uh, manufacturer information, they said they have seasoned it with sunflower oil or vegetable oil. I'll be using canola oil for seasoning this cast iron pan or the Dutch oven mm. uh, because that is that is a better oil than the sunflower oil. Okay, you can do some re research. I think flaxseed, linseed oil is the best, but I think it's expensive and it is tough to get it in India. Oh, this has been on the gas stove for a few minutes. It's pretty little tricky part to do this lid. You can see it is smoking. You can see that. This is also there. It's not smoking as much as the lid because it is in close contact. Yeah, so I just start the process. So this is the Dutch oven after uh, two days of seasoning. So we have seasoned both the lid and the oil, uh, vessel uh, twice using canola oil. Uh, then after that we cooked something which has a lot of uh, fat content and oil content. Um, it is a non veg dish. And then again we uh, cleaned the vessel and wiped it and again seize, uh, try to season it. 
so as um, you can see that still the it is it's a brownish color not the expected color but you can see some sort of uh, seasoning has happened uh, this is looking much better than what it was yesterday you can show you the colors so you can see the tint for your comparison i will show you the expected color so you can see this is my large cast stand so you can see that after the reason uh, seasoning uh, i have it for 2 3 years after this recent seasoning the color has has become very good black mm, so i have been using it for 2 3 years so this is the mm, color of a good seasoned uh, cast iron vessel uh, probably i am hoping that this will come eventually after multiple rounds of use and seasoning that's my expectation from this sign uh, then uh, then lodge is is a very good quality this known as for its cast iron product so yes so price wise i paid 2500 for this one also i think i paid around 2400 for this one two years back mm, yeah so uh, you can see the difference is that this is an indian made and this is a usa made and this is a very known brand yeah so you can see but i'm still happy with uh, this because it's, it's of course an indian made brand it's a made in india product and um, i don't see so much uh, i don't know about the quality but yeah i would uh, i don't have a as such um, comparison but i think it is worth the money like 2400 um, a large cast iron pan of this size would cost around 10k as per amazon so this i got it for like 25 percentage of the price so i think it's well worth the price probably if there is any update i will let you know yeah thank you for watching